So with that, let's jump into Revit and I'll show you how to turn these sketches that you've seen into a digestible concept diagram really quickly and simply and some tips and tricks along the way on how to make these diagrams inside of Revit. So I'm actually going to be using an in place component for this, not a mass, but a component. And you'll see what I have here is a grid system. I just kind of created a general grid with the idea of the overall length. And I'm going to actually draw extrusions. It's a simple shape. It's basically a traditional house shape. So I'm going to draw extrusions and I'm going to make these these forms um, basically solid filled forms in order to to create this massing for the diagram. So what I'm doing here is just doing an extrusion in place, assign a material to it. You can see I'm working in 3D, uh, which is very helpful here. And then I'm going to set the work plane to my front face so I can do that house shape. So again, it's just a rectangle on the floor, then just a triangle um, on the floor, level one. There's a triangle on the first face, and you can see I'm going up a specific distance um, and just kind of quickly making this, this roof shape. Yes, I could technically have drawn that on a horizontal, but I was using the floor plan to um, generate the space that I wanted. Then I combine the two, the triangle and the rectangle, and uh, I'm copying them in uh, three different places now. Uh, to represent sort of that workshop office and then this flex space in the middle. 